Hi everyone and welcome to Beauty Budgeting and More with Lizzie. I did show a first video of me by the window just showing you my uh, Restylane, um, uh, you know, how it looks now that I believe a couple of weeks have gone by, not even a month, and um, the product has settled. So I just want to go close and just show you guys, I don't know if you can see this here see this here um, I do feel the product on my eyes you know underneath I do feel it and um, you know good question would I do this again um you know I need to pontificate upon that for a while just to get I don't know just to to understand if I do want to do it again I, I'm not sure but um, I with this experience, I realized that, you know, the initial time when you do get your tear troughs done, um, you know, it takes a while to settle down. Um, what I'm doing now, I'm drinking a lot of water um, because, you know, Restylane is made from hyaluronic acid. So this is, you know, kind of water-based. So I guess if you hydrate yourself, uh, your skin will go along and it will adapt the product will adapt itself to you know to your facial structure um, I don't know if that makes any sense have to do a little more research on that guys but you know overall I have eye makeup on as you can tell and um, you know I you know I do notice that when I do wear my concealer which uh, by the way I wear age rewind by Maybelline and I want to do a video on that because that is so good I mean it is good I do um, notice that it's a big difference I don't have to you know go with that stick and try to <laughs> create magic to happen in my eyes but no it's been okay you know I uh, like the injector said you know it, it was a subtle difference but um, I guess I've gone to accept it. I didn't want to be too conspicuous or look like I was done up either because I mean I like I said in one of my videos I don't want to look fake or plastic. So anyway this is just a heads up and I hope everyone's having a great Wednesday and I will talk to you soon. Okay bye bye. Stop.